Morning class, we're looking at lab number four, the energy of a pendulum. So if you click on the link right up here, it'll open up our simulator. You wanna click on intro, and here's your general setup. Um, for the first one, you're gonna be on Earth, so the first three, so like A, B, and C you'll be on Earth. When you get to scenario D, your planet's gonna change. Highest point, you know, you, you gotta change it. But anyway, you're on Earth. It tells you right here that you want the length of the string to be one and the mass to be 1.1 kilograms. Let me set that up. Perfect, so there goes my setup. And I wanna find whatever you want to be your highest point. I'm going to call this my highest point. It's going to be super smooth. I'll know when it hits my highest point because that's where this blue hash mark is. Um, if you decide to do a different highest point, you'll get a different starting hash mark. So whatever, I would choose something that you can easily find. I'm going to go with this one. Now, you're gonna have to calculate your variables. So each of these boxes, it wants you to find out these variables. You can do that. You know the formula for potential energy at the highest point. So those first scenarios, like the highest point. Well, you, you know how to find it, MGH. You have your mass, gravity's 10 on Earth, and just measure your height. The only tricky part is, I don't know why the rule is placed this way, it should be flipped so that you're counting up to get the height. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 65. So this one has a height of 65. You gotta count upward. You're at the highest point, so you can find your PE. You know at the highest point your KE is zero. You know, I think you can make your way through. You're going to do A, B, and C. Then you just do the same thing all over again. Highest point, lowest point, and someplace in between, just on a different planet. With a different string length and a different mass. When you choose a different planet, the gravity on that planet will change. At the very top, you have your numbers for gravity on those other planets or moons. All right, I think you got it. I'm here if you need help.